Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will learn searching issues with dates. You can search Jira for things that have happened in past or will happen in future using exact dates or relative dates. Most of the searches in Jira are done with relative dates. So in JQL, if you're using a negative number, then that represents the past. But if you're using a positive number, then that represents the future. So let us go ahead and see some of the examples to understand the date functions better. So switch to advanced view, um, advanced search. And the first example that I want to show is you want to see issues due more than two days ago. Okay, so what will be the query? So due less than or equal to you want to see the past so negative number and then 2d and enter and we'll list the issue that are due more than two days ago second query you want to see issues created within last 24 hours okay so that's in the past as well so you'll use a negative number what will be the query so you'll say created is greater than or equal to negative 24 and then h for hours so it will list the issue that have been created in the past 24 hours third example you want to see issues resolved one to two weeks ago okay so what will be the query it's again in the past so you see result is greater than or equal to two weeks so minus two and then w for week and result is less than or equal to negative one week so this will list all the issues that were resolved one to two weeks ago fourth example you want to see issues due between certain dates so for example between 21st of April and 24th of April 2018 so what will be the query to see that so you'll write due and it's in the future so you'll say greater than or equal to and then the date so 2018 04 21st of April and due is less than or equal to 2018 and 24th so that will list that this query will list the issues that are due between 21st of April and 24th of April 2018 fifth example you want to see issues updated on a particular date okay exact date so for example I want to see how many issues got updated on 21st of April so the query would be updated greater than or equal to date 21st April okay and updated less than 22nd so why this query because if you just mention updated greater than or equal to 21st of April then it will list all the issues that were updated after 21st 12 a.m. after 21st of April so if you want to get the exact number of issues updated on that particular day then you have to mention the next day um, before 12 a.m. the next day so that's why updated less than 22nd of April is mentioned and that will list all the issues that were updated on 21st of April 
Now, another example is you want to see issues due within next two days. Okay, so next two days is in future, so that will be a positive number. Okay, so due less than or equal to next two days, so positive two and D, and we'll list the issues that are due in next two days. Now, last example is you want to see issues created in last two days okay so created and then greater than or equal to so last two days is again in past then minus 2d and we'll list all the issues that were created in last two days so you can see the issues created on 21st and 22nd april are listed here so that is all about searching with dates in jql in next tutorial we will learn about searching with text thank you